Merry Christmas everyone, welcome to Rogue Road at Restore, I'm John and in this video I will be showing you some new parts we have gotten for the CBR1000F landfill bike and I must say one of the parts is a major part what I've been looking for for yonks and yes this new part means we are no longer the arse end of nowhere with this project so stay tuned to see what it is. Okay, so as some of you probably remember, if you've been following the project, I managed to purchase this uh, back in the summertime when it was nice and warm. A replacement cylinder head, which I really needed. So I will be stripping this down, changing the valve seals, reseating all the valves. So some of you have already seen that. But you definitely haven't seen this. I've already uh, opened the box just to have a quick glance of uh, all the goodies inside. So let's have a look and see what we've got. So we've got this. I have no clue as to what it is. Uh, we've got that, which is the uh, battery cable. Uh, we've got these, which feel a bit manky. Pretty brittle. Feels okay. That's the back one, obviously. Uh, what we got in this little packet? Uh, yes, we've got either a little knife to open these. Careful you don't chop your fingers off. Ooh. You can see that push drive bubbles for the back wheel, a sprocket. I must say the wife purchased this for me, it was a job lot. It was £20 free postage. I think I know what that is. No, I'm not sure what that is. Let's have a look. I need a bigger knife. Some sort of cables. Oh. I think that's a rear brake master cylinder. No. No, I don't think that's the rear brake master cylinder. In fact, I have no idea what it is. Drop a comment if you know what that is, because I ain't got no clue. If it was the rear brake master cylinder, there'd be some plunger would be coming out one of these parts I'm sure. Uh, yes drop a comment if you know what that is. It's obviously something to do with the brakes. Anyway what next? Oh yes chain guard. Hope that fits because I don't know if you remember that I chopped mine up. Mine was all part of the rear wheel ugger and I uh, cut it off, cut the rear auger off to make a rear mud guard. So hopefully that will fit, so that will come in useful. Uh, those are just the uh, kicker plates. 
you know, put rest go through there and your eels catch on them. Uh, I think that's a oil cool up, which I do need, if it's good. It looks pretty good. Yes, I definitely need an oil cool up. So that's another thing that will come in handy. Uh, I think that's a rear sprocket. Nope, it's not a rear sprocket. It's a black engine cover. Cool. Oh, pretty good as well. These aren't normally black, are they? They're normally silver. So hopefully that will polish up nicely and go well with my uh, black paint on the engine. Okay, what else we got? That's an egg stock which I don't need. What's this? Right. Just a foot hanger. Will be any good. Uh, not too bad. What next? Uh, I wonder what that is. Uh, that's a gearbox push rod. Uh, like a starter solenoid or a relay. Uh, there's the oak strap for the battery. Uh, not sure what that is. shifter. Cool. Not sure what this is. Well, I think I know what it is. So the uh, rear wheel are just as a bit better than mine when they're all crowded up. What is this? Oh, I know what this is. These are the uh, frame protectors. Uh, last but not least in this box. They look like nuts and bolts or something. Oh. <laughs> yeah, dear me. Yes, I think they're for the mirrors. That's a rear foot rest. I think that's a choke, but not for this bike, I don't know, it might be. That's a engine pole. So all that stuff. Now let's get ready for the main event. So here we are, the main part. I've been searching for, for I don't know how long, and believe you me, it cost me a fortune. Anybody guess what it is yet? It's a fragile. I bought a fragile. Let's have a look, shall we? Oh, it's exciting. Anybody would think it's Christmas. Oh. 
this is the first time I'm seeing this. Ow! Oh my god! Bring you in closer. Smell it. Oh my God, look at that. Ooh, baby, baby, hello. What's your name then? Fantastic! Perfectly bloody splendid! So, can you tell I'm happy? Yes, that cost £100, believe it or not. 100 quid! Bloody hell! But it means this CBR 1000 F landfill bike build is no longer at the arse end of nowhere. So there you go, just a little update on all the parts I've uh, gotten for the bike. I've got some more new parts coming, but uh, you'll see them as the uh, project goes along. Uh, you've probably noticed in the background Another little project I'm working on, so stay tuned for that. Shouldn't really show it you now because it's going to spoil the video when it comes out. Don't look. Oh, and I can't wait till that's up and running. Hopefully, I'll be in here with my t shirt on. So, there you go, just a little update on the parts for the uh, Landville bike. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you all have a very Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year. Stay safe, stay well, uh, I'll see you when I see you. Take care, out there. I see you in another light, brother.